This is the Nubia X, and the more observant among you will notice that there's no camera at the top, there's no camera at the bottom, there's no motorized cameras hiding away. So how on earth do you take a selfie with this phone? Nubia's come up with a new solution, no notches, no punch holes or anything like that. Their solution is to put a screen on the back of your phone. That's right, a screen on the back. So this is a dual screen phone. As you can see there, this is automatically swapping around. And the clever part of it is, it uses the rear camera as your selfie cam. So you just open the camera, and because we're on the rear, there's me, hey. That now becomes your selfie camera. You turn it around, and under normal circumstances, that would then be your front camera. So we'll just come out of this, turn the phone around, and we're back on the main screen. Open the camera, and there it is using it for the back. We think it's a really neat solution, and not just neat, but so cool to look at. This is a beautiful rear cover. I mean, even without the screen, this is super reflective. It's made of glass, obviously, and this screen is fully functional. You can use it under normal circumstances. Not only can you use it under normal circumstances, but you can use it at the same time as the front screen. So how that works is you can alter the settings so that the screen on the rear will be able to be used for a single app. So say for example, you're playing a game on the front screen, you could be having a text conversation on the back using the Messages app, completely separate to what's going on on the front screen, whilst both are still working. Alternatively, still playing that game, what you might decide to do is to use a control method on the rear. Nubia's engineered this in such a way that it can split the screen down. And in certain games, they obviously have to be specially adapted to use this. But you can use the rear of the phone like this to control a game. So it could be for movement, it could be for gunfire, whatever. But it becomes a full screen experience because there's nothing getting in the way of the display on the front. Same thinking behind the punch hole. And we think that's really smart. The rest of this phone, well, it's technically very impressive. There's a Snapdragon 845 processor inside. There's two cameras on the rear. That's a 24 megapixel and a 16 megapixel. So it's strong forms there. There's a 38 milliamp hour battery inside. This is a 6.2 inch full HD screen. Unusually, it's got two screens. Well, it's also got two fingerprint sensors. There's a fingerprint sensor on this side, and a fingerprint sensor on this side. You do need to use them both to unlock the phone. And that's pretty rare. The reason the thinking behind it, according to Nubia, is that one is secure, while two is even more secure. Because they're located here where we naturally grip the phone, it's not gonna be a pain where there are two on the rear, which would obviously be impossible to use. But this way, it's actually quite convenient. And logically enough, that is more secure. What else can you do with that rear screen? as you can see here this is the rear of the phone and it's been set up so that it's just showing a clock so you could have this sitting down on the desk face down but you can still see pertinent information on the rear it's got the date it's got the time it's got the battery and it'll give you notifications too you can set this up to pretty much how you like and at this point you can see just how beautiful this phone looks you'd hardly believe that's a screen underneath there it just looks like it's been etched into the body. This is a gold and blue as well, and it's quite a fetching colour. So do you want the Nubia X? Well, of course you do. Who wouldn't want cool tech like that? Because it really is absolutely awesome. Well, you can't have it unless you import one from China. This is only available in China at the moment. However, Nubia tells us that the sequel to the Nubia X is planned for release internationally. Now, if you're wondering whether that really means North America, Nubia is about to launch the sequel to its current gaming phone, and that's coming to North America in the next few months. So it's definitely making plans. That means the next dual screen phone from Nubia could be on sale in the US. And we think that's a really exciting new advancement on the way to give you a full screen display on the front without cameras and all sorts of other things. This is the Nubia X.